the Lib Dems must be condemned to being treated with maximum contempt forever. They are the ones that uh, effectively uh, allowed David Cameron to impose austerity and uh, to usurp even liberal values. So the Lib Dems, um, if there is any justice in this world, mm. will go nowhere near government and especially they will not go near government on the coattails of, a, of, a, of the Labour Party and the Corbyn's Labour Party. Yes, we do need a coalition, but the Labour Party is the coalition. The Labour Party is a broad church. Uh, that doesn't mean that you don't um, strike uh, deals or you have a good understanding with people like Carl and and Lucas here in Brighton from the Green Party, with the Scottish National Party. Absolutely, absolutely. But uh, you draw a line somewhere. And I think that the line needs to be drawn um, on the question of austerity and the, on the question of property rights. Anyone who challenges the need to reverse decades of austerity and anybody who challenges the need to shift property rights from the few to the many should, should simply have no place in such a coalition. So you're reversing privatisation, the Liberal Democrats disagree, we should... They're out. They're out. Let them, you know, hobnob with Johnson. They deserve it. What do you think it says more generally about liberalism today? And it's dead. It's a dead ideology. It's, it's, I mean, not liberalism. Yeah. The liberals' liberalism. Yeah. Because they betrayed it. They introduced, Nick Clegg was responsible for introducing hugely anti-liberal legislation. Legislation that denied people, you know, people are on remand, their basic habeas corpus rights. So when the Liberal Party, it's a bit like Syriza in Greece, when the, 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 the coalition of the radical left cuts the lowest pensions that there are, mm. um, privatizes everything, mm. <laughs> uh, and imposes huge stringent austerity, mm. it seems to be, it's not that the left has failed, it's not that the, that the socialism has died as an idea, it's that this party is no longer um, able uh, to, to, to be counted as part of the left. Similarly, I mean, I think that liberalism is, is always going to be with us. And, you know, I have a libertarian stick in me. Mm. And I think that, you know, Karl Marx had one too. You can't be a, a believer in the emancipation of the working class, of women, of blacks, of minorities, and not be a liberal. Emancipation is, is a liberal uh, and even libertarian project. Mm. But the Lib Dems have abandoned liberalism a long time ago.